Okay, boys, hello again. This is the second part of our class. And in the class before, our title was Identifying Angles in Objects, in Real Life Objects. Now we are going to do the same, but identify angles in shapes, okay? So I'm going to bring a very common shape that all of you know. Let me make it bigger. This is a rectangle. Okay, so the same way we saw it in objects, who can tell me, and if you watch the video later, then I'm going to give you 10 seconds to think, where can you find an angle? And exactly the same way as in the cereal box and all the objects, wherever you find two lines like here, one, two, but now that we are going to uh, do it with shapes, we count the complete side and this side. So two sides of a shape, they connect in a corner or a vertex, okay? Vertex. Sorry, but you know I am doing this with a paintbrush and a mouse. A vertex or corner. So when two sides of a shape connect, we form an angle. So from here to here, we can see how open these two sides are. So that's one angle. Where can we find another angle? Exactly this same line, but now I'm going to paint it green. But now with this side, our other two sides, and from here to here, we make other angle. Where else can we find another angle? Exactly, this same side, but now they connect with this side. So from here to here, we can find another angle. And we still have another one. Where do you see another angle? Wow, you are amazing. So this side of the shape with this side, from here to here, these two lines or sides form an angle. So that rectangle, how many sides did we find? Let's count. One, two, three, four. So we have four sides. And how many angles did we draw? One, two, three, four angles. We also have four angles. Four sides, four angles. Okay, let's look at the next shape. Oops, oopsie. I have to erase line by line. Now I have one with more sides and one at more angles. So let's do it faster. The sides is very easy. How many sides, sides does this shape have? Let's count. So this is, let me choose another color. No. Let's pick orange. One, two, three, four, five, six sides. So, Let's draw right that it has six sides. The sides, super easy. The angles, remember, is the opening of two lines, okay? So from this line to this line, here we have an angle. From this line to this line, here we have an angle. From this line to this line, they connect here, so here we have an angle. They connect here, these two lines, or sides, so here we have an angle. So how many angles do we have in all in this shape? I'm not going to finish it. You finish in your mind. Exactly. We had two more angles. So that means we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So this shape had six sides, six angles. Very good. So let's do the next one. Now we have a circle. Who can tell me how many angles do we have? 
and how many sides? Very good, all the ones that said zero and zero. Because an angle is made by two straight lines, well, not exactly straight, but not curved, okay? Two rays, two line segments, or two lines, okay? And the opening tells you the angle. So here, we don't have straight lines. We don't have rays, we don't have line segments, so we don't have an angles in a curved figure or shape. Understand? The last one. Oops. The last one. How many sides do we have here? Excellent. We have three sides. That's the easy part. How many angles? Excellent. So this side, i sorry. It's too long. I did it fast. This side and this side form one angle. This side and this side, other angle. This side and this side, other angle. So we have one, two, three angles. So who can tell me what did you notice about the number of sides and the number of angles of each shape? A pat on your back. Exactly, it's the same. The number of sides gives you the same number of angles. Great job. So now it's time to go and answer your math page. Super easy. Don't do the let's learn because that's what we just did. Just answer this. The square has how many sides and how many angles. And then you answer this. How many sides? How many angles? How many sides? How many angles? How many sides? How many angles? And the same question. What do you notice about the number of sides and the number of angles on each shape? So, I hope everyone has a great class. You get 100. And if you don't, I am still going to be in the chat if you have any questions. So.